Hello, this is Clayton Balmas, and I'm your teacher here today, here at Synmax University, and uh, we're, today we're speaking on behalf of uh, Burplum Magic Products with uh, BurplumMagic.com. Uh, what we're talking about today is a grease performance test, which is Burplum Magic versus the national competitive product. So I, I hope that you'll enjoy being with me and sharing as uh, listening as much as I do sharing with you. So let's go along for the ride. Burple Magic products are performance tested and original equipment approved by Bert himself. Here is a letter addressed to Wade Hegler of Wade on Racing at Waxhaw, North Carolina, dated April 15, 2010. Dear Wade, I am pleased to confirm with you and any other owner of a Burt Transmission the following. Burt Blue Magic lubrication products have received my Burt Transmission approval for use including the standard or advanced Pro Series design transmissions with or without a ball spline. And we'll talk about the grease portion of the letter. Burt Blue Magic, after evaluation, observation, and testing in 2009 and early 2010, the Burt Blue Magic ball spline grease with its special formulation design has proven to increase overall ball spline durability with performance life cycles as compared to other standard or performance greases used. Ball spline had increased life with considerably less wear upon the ball bearing and spline surfaces. The special design grease was able to lubricate with continued repeatability and handle the high 9,000 plus RPMs without breaking down and was able to stay and stick upon the bearings and spline without slinging out. Serviceability and maintenance was greatly improved and made easier through the Burt Blue Magic Ball Spline Grease Kit with special rubber applicator needle and 3 ounce refill cartridges. The bearings and ball spline shaft operated cleaner and cooler with less wear and less friction. Therefore, accept this document as our approval and endorsement of the Burt Blue Magic products. Wade, we appreciate the joint efforts you and Synmax have put forth regarding the successful developments of these specialized lubrication products for the Burt transmission applications. If anyone has questions or requires advice, Regarding the application or performance of these products, I want them directed toward the websites of BurtBlueMagic.com or WaitOnRacing.com. Sincerely, Burt, Burt Transmissions, Quebec, Canada. Here is Burt at the IMIS show at Indianapolis. And this is the same booth that you would have seen at the Performance Race Industry Show in Orlando, Florida, sharing about the Burt Blue Magic products. Now here's a brochure available for the grease, grease gun kit with the special applicator devices available at BurtBlueMagic.com. Here is Burt at his booth at the IMIS show in Indianapolis. And it's the same booth that you would have seen at the Performance Race Industry Show in Orlando, Florida endorsing and sharing about the Burt Blue Magic products. Here is the brochure which is for the two-speed racing fluid for the Burt transmission available at BurtBlueMagic.com. In 2009 a product evaluation test was performed on two separate standard Burt two-speed transmissions with the ball spline unit. This took place in 2009. Both cars were equally prepared in similar series and had between 35 and 40 competition races on it. Transmission A had the Burt Blue Magic uh, special ball spline grease and Transmission B had the national brand which just happened to be uh, the high performance Mobile One synthetic grease. Here's the observation. And throughout the presentation, you will see the pictures uh, of this test. On the left, you have the Burt Blue Magic ball bearings, which use the Burt Blue Magic grease. These were the results of the performance test after the one year. You will notice that the surfaces are slightly dull and still smooth to close to new, but the bearings could be reused. 
the center bearings are brand new Burt ball spline bearings that you would get in a kit or for rebuild or brand new. On the right, you have the Mobile One uh, synthetic grease. You will notice that the surfaces are darker, pitted, and scarred due to friction, fretting, heat, and lack of lubrication. These bearings needed replacement. On the left, you'll see the results of the Burt Blue Magic uh, Science Technology. In the center, you will have the brand new Burt ball bearings, and on the right, the Mobile One Lithium Grease Technology. In the center, you have the Burt. On the left, you have the Blue Magic Science Technology of Grease, and on the right, you have the Mobile One lithium technology. In the front you have the Mobile One uh, grease technology in the center brand new and on the top the results of the Burt Blue Magic special ball spline grease. Again here's a closer evaluation of the Burt Blue Magic special high RPM grease formulation in action after one year of use. Here you see the Burt Blue Magic Special Ball Spline Grease. This is, as shared before, a calcium sulfonate complex. You will see a, sp a special tachifier package. This is a light and fluffy type grease with science technology inside of it, where it has a special tachifier. Are all greases tacky? Well, to a point. But this has a special tachifier additive which allows the grease to crawl when it's cold and then adhere the additive packages of the oils and the anti-seize and anti-friction properties directly to the surface of the bearings and that of the spline. So that is why uh, this has the performance that it does. Furthermore, 100% waterproof. Again, here's the Burt Blue Magic Science Grease Technology on the left with the, compared to the brand new bearings on the right. Here is the Mobile One. This is a lithium product. The difference between a calcium sulfonate complex and a lithium is calcium sulfonate has the oils and the thickener all put together as one. A lithium is a product where they take soap which is lithium and mix the oils. One of the issues that happens is sometimes there is a separation of the oils and the thickener. Now this also could have had some possible uh, maintenance issues or we, we're not sure but this was greased uh, on a continued basis. But you will see that the surface was darker, pitted, fatigued and scarred due to lack of lubrication and the bearings needed replacement. Again, as you look closer, you will see the pits upon the balls. Where does this come from? When the surface gets hot, it opens up like a micron metal sponge. And then when it opens up and the sprawls open up upon the surface, little pieces of the metal start to break off. And then when they break off, they, they become a part of the grease, and then they start to bang into, into the bearing. That is where you see the dimples. They started out like the bearings on top. But this is the result of them on the bottom. Here you will see the pitting and the scarring on the bearings. So in comparison between advanced grease science technology with the Burt Blue Magic on the left and the Mobile One Lithium technology on the right, which is available across the nation, you will now see the ability of the choice of, uh, that people can make. The testing results and evidence has proven over one year of racing presented within these pictures that it is clear the Burt Blue Magic Grease product and maintenance specifically designed for the Burt two-speed transmission and ball spline application was successful and exceeded all factory expectations. The Burt Blue Magic Grease as maintained held up and did not break down under dirt, moisture, high RPMs over 9,000 RPMs, and extreme duty conditions over 800 horsepower, further extending and doubling the cycle time of the Burt ball spline unit, which is 
Very important because a ball spline unit costs close to $600 and the rebuild kit almost $75 now. You see, under normal high G 9000 RPM conditions, the grease as the spline moves back and forth is, is, is thrown to the spline ends, leaving the center where the bearings are dry with no lubrication protection. This is normally evident during rebuilds. They'll see grease on the ends, but in the center, no grease. But the discovery was that the Burt Blue Magic Special Formulated Calcium Sulfonate Complex had longer grease life with stability to stick and roll upon the bearing spline shaft surfaces without slinging out. As the spline and bearing moves back and forth, the Burt Blue Magic Grease kept the bearings cool, lubricated, and protected. This was evident by how well the surface of the bearing uh, was able to sustain a, a, a proper life. The bearing surfaces did not experience metal fatigue or fretting. In other words, small pieces of metal breaking off, creating pits due to heat, of friction, and torque, as compared to the other standard commercial products used. Further noted, the bearing surfaces had a Rockwell hardness test inspection, and it was indicated that the bearing specifications were within 90% of original factory tolerances. They were acceptable and safe for reuse. Now we have to make a note here that this testing was not against any company or product used. It just happened that the performance with the lithium-based grease used in Transmission B, which was of the customer's choice, was of one of the national leading brands, Mobile One Synthetic. So this is Clayton Balmas here with uh, Synmax University. And on behalf of Burt, Burt Transmissions, and Burt Blue Magic products available at BurtBlueMagic.com, uh, we encourage you to see our other sessions on video, on the net, and on our web on the web page. So until I, we visit again in our next session, bye now. For technical test and brochure information on how the aerospace advantage for motorsports can work for your race team or other commercial requirements, please visit us at SynMaxPerformanceLubricants.com.